so uh, welcome to CES 2010 where we have uh, Android arm powered is it arm powered Android arm powered laptop this is tiny it's seven inch yep. seven inch screen you have it right here this is this is like um, and it's cheap it's cheap as well. You, uh, how much does it cost? Uh, 140 to 150. 140 around yeah. there. 140, yeah. 150. Yeah. If you order a few, if you order, if you order more, if you order, or if you want to order thousands, it's gonna go down the price. Yeah. And um, so, if you want, you can uh, come closer, and then we can check it out. So it's uh, it, has, it has the full Android interface. And uh, are you connected to the internet right now? Uh, I think so. Yeah. Uh, let's let's try and uh, it says no service, but I'll try and, and search for um, this one. Let's see what happens. It's going on Google.com, and right here it's a pretty. It, it seemed it seemed to be pretty speedy. Uh, you're using the the Google um, browser right here, and um, everything is in focus. You see it see well. So I, I'm able to scroll down right here. And this is a, a pretty speedy Android interface. Do you have anything about the specs of, the, of this laptop? Does it say uh, uh, what? What do, what do you show about it? You show um, you show here. So it has a seven-inch LCD. Um, it's the Freescale IMX um, 533 megahertz IMX 31. It is uh, ARM 11 based. Yeah. Uh, 128 megabyte RAM, 4 gigabyte SD card inside. Uh, you include that or no? You have to add it. Or, but you have these different three. What are those different three ones? Are they all three similar? Uh, no. 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 So this is the GL750, 750, 7, 7 inch screen, 800 times 480, Freescale IMX31, 533 megahertz, ARM 11. Uh, it has 128 megabyte TDR RAM, and you can have a uh, SD card. You can add whatever SD card you want inside. And uh, here, here it looks. Here, that's what it looks like. And uh, if we click around, and if I try to go back, then I can uh, I can search. Let me search for uh, ARM uh, devices. Let's see if it can find my site. The site is kind of new. And uh, here, we are on devices, and you can click here. Loading my website, and my website is, uh, I'm just guessing, maybe it doesn't work, maybe it work, it doesn't work, because my, my site has a whole bunch of, of YouTube things going on. So I'm, I'm just gonna see if uh, any of the YouTube is actually gonna work. Is it gonna work, the YouTube? Uh, not really, yeah. Not really? Yeah. So I'm just gonna click just to see what happens, but yeah. uh, we'll see what happens. So YouTube for now is doesn't work. There's some kind of uh, it's trying to do a link to to a video somehow. There might be a solution later. Yeah, because Loi yeah. now uh, is still does still under development. No flash, yeah. no flash yet, but yeah. it will come. Yeah. It will come very soon. Yeah. And so, is there a scroll bar or is it only the, these buttons, right? So when I scroll is here. So I scroll down like this. But so this whole thing is under the, under under development, and um, as you can see, the Nexus One. So the, the pictures from from YouTube show up, and the play button is there. But uh, Adobe is still just about to optimize all the Flash support and all that, and they will support it. I mean, as soon as this hits the market uh, at full speed. But there you have it, a seven inch, and you even have. They even have a GL850, which has an 8.9 inch screen, and it's just basically the same, but it's a little bit bigger screen, and maybe a little bit more expensive. Yeah, yeah of course. It should be more expensive. But there you have all the, the websites working, and if I just start typing, let's start typing, uh, I want to type this site, a famous site about uh, consumer electronics. So if I type this site in, I just type it in, I hit enter, and we see how many seconds it takes. This is ARM 11, so you have to consider it's ARM 11, but it kind of seems super usable. And there the site is loading. It's a very big site. The site is like, I don't know, two or three megabytes. It has all these pictures everywhere. There's many, 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 many pictures. But it's still, it's, it's working. The Apple tablet rumor, 
it's not uh, about silk. I don't, not gonna read that. I don't care. And uh, then I go scroll down a bit. MSI has uh, uh, yellow sliding. Only one has on. Okay. And then next story is Microsoft. Okay. And the next. This is totally usable. The whole thing is working, and uh, I can just click escape, ex exit, and I'm back back to my previous site. And so, if I go back to the main menu, is there a shortcut for that? I can get, get back to the main menu. Down here, we have. Uh, if I click F1, there's uh, the, the windows, so I can add. Uh, I can just say, let's stop the browsing, and I'll hit F1 again. And there's um, the more. We can go in settings over here. Let's see what happens. This is a full Android. You can change the text size. You can do all these things in Android. You can uh, uh, you have Google Gears? I mean, it's the full Android. Everything is here. So if I go back to the there it is just click exit a few times, and I can open the menu. And you, you, do you play back videos? You can play videos. Yeah, sure. So right here, you're displaying the videos like this, right? It says the, the name of the file, or no, or the name of the file, the, the resolution, and the codex. And so what you do is you just select the video, and it just plays, full screen. So right here, we were playing, uh, I forgot to look what I was clicking on, but we were playing at 320. So it's QBGA. Can you play more than that? Can you play different resolutions? Can you play DVD resolution or is only QBJ? Uh, I believe that. We will see. It's going to come later. The optimizations. But uh, you have this laptop, 140 US dollars. That, that's just like a to kind of give an idea what it might cost. If, if you order 10,000 pieces, if you order 100,000 pieces and you are Walmart, you can get them for maybe $100 or cheaper. I mean, it can be cheaper if you if you want to order many 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 pieces, and it can be mass manufactured. Uh, is it sold a lot uh, somewhere or not yet? Not yet. Not yet. So this is really just to show right here at CES 2010, the world's first seven-inch Android laptop. Super super. Uh, and if I click here, maybe it's gonna go to power off right here. And here, there's a difference. It says your device will shut down. Oh, there's one more thing I wanted to check, and I hope uh, you don't mind that I check it. I will go in settings, and I will check uh, what version of Android. Can I do that? Yeah, sure. Okay, I'll, I'll go down to about device, and I'll check what does it say here. So for now, you're using uh, 1.5, Android 1.5. Are you gonna upgrade? Yeah. The future? Yeah. So yeah. when when? Uh, maybe not. Maybe in two months there will be new versions of, uh, and you call it the G netbook. Yeah. And uh, there's EMI. There's no 3G. No 3G built in, right? Yeah. I mean, you don't have 3G built in. You have the this this uh, sparing thing. The, no 3G. The, the modules are options. We can play on the board. Ah, you yeah. could even add 3G. So there's an optional to have the 3G built in. And uh, otherwise, I mean, it's right here. And you call it the GSoft version uh, yeah. 1.0. Release candidate 2. So it's right here. The Android 7 inch laptop, less than $140. 140 or less, very basic. And the software is definitely better than having a Windows CE. It's, it's the best Linux you could have on, on this kind of device. So that's cool. Thanks. I'm just going to turn it off as I wanted to do before and see what happens. Okay, shut down. gonna boot it up just to try. So I clicked on the power button and it says Android and right here we can see their system version 1.0. The Android is blinking in the, in the corner. This is so cool. 7 inch super cheap ARM 11 laptop. Uh, 7 inch GNB. Just contact them, send them an email, and say I want to order 10,000. It's easy. Gnetbook.com. You have information on your site? Yeah. So everything is there as well. Yeah. Do you have videos there? Uh, no. No, you can add this video yeah. if you want. Oh, it's finished. It's boot. 
I looked away and it's already booted up. So there you have it. The whole thing is, is ready. And uh, we checked it already, so we don't need to check the whole thing again. Even though it's so cool, I like to go in file manager just to, because I think it's cool. Right here, so we are in the file manager. You have some pictures or something in there? No, it's empty. No, no. The picture is on the, on the SD card. And you have some application? No. Did you try and install some? So uh, you we, can install some? Yeah, we, we installed a dictionary inside. Yeah. yeah. So does uh, Skype work if I install it? Uh, we already installed, so you may not. You, I don't need to. Yeah, yeah. It show on the desktop. It does. Yeah. So it's. Is it in here? Yeah, it's like that's all right. Ah, die. Okay. Yeah. So you already installed everything yeah. on this. Yeah. So it basically you can add a whole bunch of APKs. Yeah. You just add them, yeah. and you have. That's your demo. Is there anyone you didn't install yet? No. You just not. try. Yeah. You all installed. Yeah, yeah. Minesweeper also. Notepad, but if we click on one, is it okay? Then it will just say it's already installed. No? Do you want to install the application? Let's see what happens. Installing application installed, so I can open it. There you have it. You have the Minesweeper. This is the future. Cool. So you can you can play it Minesweeper. I don't know how Minesweeper works, but there it is. You have the games. It's so responsive. It's fast. It's cool. This is totally usable. Children can use it. It's cool. Uh, 